To our top story tonight, sheer chaos in downtown Cincinnati this morning when a gunman opened fire at a bank, sending people running for their lives. Four people, including the gunman, are dead. Two victims remain in the hospital. It happened at the Fifth Third Bank headquarters on Walnut Street. Lee Searcy has more details in the LEX 18 Big Story at 5. What started out as a normal day here in downtown Cincinnati quickly turned into a scene of panic and chaos. It all went down right over there in the Fifth Third Bank building. No one saw it coming. Police say a man dressed in a business suit entered the loading dock area of the bank, then opened fire before making his way to the lobby, where police say he fired shots again. The city's mayor describing the mass shooting as horrific, but commended the fast action of Cincinnati officers who ultimately killed the suspect. Witnesses say an unsuspecting woman wearing headphones was seen walking into the bank's lobby during the gunfire. A witness told us she felt helpless watching from her office window that overlooks the bank. She saw a woman shot near a flagpole, then quickly attended to by an ambulance. In all, police say five innocent victims were shot. Three of them died. Another witness describes people scurrying for cover. Yeah, we started seeing people duck and then heard the gunshots. And then it was just uh, total chaos. People running, kind running, of Running, crouching it. down, hiding. It was, it was really scary. So what led to this mass shooting? More on the investigation coming up tonight at 6. Covering the news in downtown Cincinnati, Lee Searcy, LEX 18 News, back to you. And just released by Cincinnati police a short time ago, the gunman was 29-year-old Omar Perez.